hello guys welcome back to our youtube channel it support and in this video i will show you how to deploy your project through jenkins to your tomcat server so uh, in this in this video i will create a new uh, job and through that job it will uh, compile the maven based project and uh, after uh, compiling it will deploy a dot var file into the tomcat server so uh, uh, this this is my jenkin dashboard uh, how to install jenkin and how to integrate jenkin with uh, github is already uh, already discussed in a previous video uh, if you don't know how to integrate just go and watch the videos let me show you so here is integration github with a jenkin account you can watch this video you will get the idea how to integrate Gen, uh, github with jenkin and in this video you will get to learn how to install jenkin with maven and java and in the third video you will learn how to uh, pull and push your uh, github account uh, to your local computer using git and how to install tomcat is already discussed in the videos so just go and watch and then you will you can watch this video so let me start with the new job i'm naming it new build and select this as a maven based project select ok now give the description first project or whatever you want to give I'm using git and uh, you need to define the git URL for the repository inside your github account this is my github account I want to use this maven project so I'm going there and just copy the link from here and put it here and here I'm selecting the github account username and password which is already created and then you should go and select pole SCM here I'm giving value 5 star that means it will uh, fetch the new content the changed content from the github account and it will automatically start building Jenkins will st automatically start building the project and it will automatically deploy to the Tomcat server. So I am selecting poll SEM and uh, every minute the value is setting for every minute. Now you need to go into post build step. Here you need to select You should go into post build action you need to select deploy e var slash er to container and here you need to define the file name star slash star dot var and container my my the uh, tomcat server is 8.5 so i'm selecting 8.8 point, 8 point x here and here you need to uh, define the username and the password for tomcat now let's go into tomcat this is my tomcat web url and this is my tomcat server let me uh, show you the installation directory for this tomcat apache this is my installed directory for apache now uh, these are the all uh, related file for the uh, tomcat and uh, you need to go in conf directory ls and here you will see this is the user configuration file uh, just open it and uh, let me show you here i added the three user First is the master GUI user, second is the admin GUI, and third is the manager script. I'm using this manager script role to, ins to copy the wire file from Jenkins to the uh, Tomcat server. So uh, all these three users I have defined here, username and password for it. 
so for uh, for manager script the username is deploy and the password is deployer so you need to define this value inside the tomcat server and also you should go inside let me go out web app then uh, you should go inside host manager and then meta inf and then context.xml file you should come here and then you should comment this value the same like i have commented it this two line should be commented and just save and quit from here and then you can start the tomcat server so this is this is the configuration about the tomcat server uh, and and the var file which is getting copied into web app here it will get copied so new new var file will be getting copied so the uh, last let me delete web.var and uh, web directory from here so here no web app directory and web app dot var file here let me let me configure it to the jenkin and jenkin will deploy this two file into my tomcat server and this is my jenkin server right and this is the web url for the jenkin now here you need to select the url of the tomcat server so we need to copy this url and paste here right then save project is created this one new build now go inside this project and just say build now Now it is started building just go into console output and you will see it is compiling the it is fetching the content from the uh, github account and then it will compile using java and maven it will create the build and that that build will be getting copied into the uh, tomcat server so here the result is saying finished success now go into tomcat server and do ll now here you can see these two directories got created and if you go into the tomcat server if you refresh you will see uh, the content is loading from the tomcat server now if i go and change the value inside project let me refresh this page go inside src web app index.jsp if i change the value inside index.jsp uh, the jenkin will automatically start pulling the new content and it will start building the project and it will automatically deploy the dot var file inside the tomcat let me change it in place of exclamatory mark i'm putting at the red symbol add it this is commit message add it. save it once i saved it if you come in jenkin home page after one minute it will automatically start building new project so let's wait for one minute so now here you can see the uh, build it start creating if you come here this is automatically pulled from the github and 
just start building the project if you come here and see the console output So now here it is saying failure. So the build is successfully created, but uh, it is not deployed. So we need to find out the uh, error message. So here it is saying build step failed with exception failed to deploy, right? so it is it is because of my previous project because my one of one of my project is also fetching the content from the github so let me delete that this i need to delete now again let me make any change to this file adding extra exclamatory mark here this is commit message the file is saved now come here and open this project now let's wait to run this automatically wait for one minute So it started uh, building the project. Now come here and see the console output. now it is saying success so if you come here and reload the page now here you can see the uh, content for the tomcat server is got changed so guys this is how this is a simple uh, ci cd project that you can build using github jenkin and the tomcat server in next video i will show you how you can introduce Gen uh, ansible in this in the same project so in next video i will show you how you can pull the content from github through jenkin and how you uh, deploy the build to the ansible and how ansible will uh, deploy the content uh, to the tomcat server so guys thank you for watching this video bye bye